Hi, I'm Larry Janeski from Dr. Energy Saver. One of the things we do at Dr. Energy Saver is replace windows with high efficiency windows to save energy and make your home more comfortable. Today, we're at this house where we're replacing 11 windows. Let's take a look. Now, these are old wood windows. There's many kinds of windows, but this is the most common kind. It's a double hung window. And what we're gonna do is remove the stop molding on the inside and remove the sashes and then remove the jam expander or the track, if you wanna call it that. And then we're gonna put our new replacement window in. Sometimes you have different kinds of windows or different width walls. Sometimes you may have to remove the entire jam and the casing, which is the interior trim, and the sill and the apron, and retrim the whole window afterwards. The good news is you get some new trim, but you've got to stain and polyurethane or paint it after the window has been replaced. Um, the bad news is that, of course, that's going to cost a little bit more, but with your new energy efficient windows with new trim, you'll be very happy. Let me show you another thing that could be done when we replace windows to make them as energy efficient as possible. Now, when many people think they have leaky windows and that's because they feel a draft. Well, the draft is for a number of reasons. It could be uh, certainly it's because of the glass is cold and when air from inside the room hits the cold glass, it descends and runs up the interior wall and then down hits the glass, gets cold again and descends and it creates a convective loop. Here's another little trick and this is, uh, I can guarantee you that no uh, replacement window companies do this, but that is to try to seal the shim space between the existing window and the framed opening. What we can do is drill a hole here and we have our foam gun with a needle. When I pull the trigger, this foam is coming out of the gun like that. And we stick it in there. I'm pulling the trigger right now. All that foam is going into that shim space. So what, what is that gonna do for us? Well, it's gonna prevent cold air from coming in around this casing here or here. Um, and uh, stop airflow. And that's very important. You won't get that with any standard replacement window service. This is an extra step that we go through to ensure that these windows are as energy efficient as possible. We're gonna put a bead of foam on the bottom so that when we set the window down, it goes right into this bed of foam. Another feature of modern high quality windows is that they tilt in for easy cleaning. So I'd be able to clean my windows even if it was on the second or third floor very easily. Okay, well let's take a look at these new windows. These new windows are more energy efficient than the old windows. That's the reason to replace them in the first place. First of all, we have um, double glazing. And double glazing, two pieces of glass, provides a space between the glass so that um, we don't get as much heat transmittance through the glass itself. In that space, one of the things, the opportunities that we have is to fill that space with argon gas instead of air. Now argon gas is an inert gas, but it doesn't allow the heat to transmit uh, through the two panes of glass as easily as just uh, air would. We also have low E glass, and this is very important. Low E glass is low emissivity. And that means that we can let visible light through, but we're gonna block a large portion of the part of the light spectrum that carries heat, that radiates heat. So low E glass prevents heat flow from the outside in in the summer and from the inside out in the winter. Now we can see that the glass is a little bit tinted and sort of like sunglasses. And that's one way that you can tell that it's low E glass where clear glass will let all that heat right through. Another element of this window is we can see that it has a vinyl frame. And vinyl never needs paint. Uh, it won't rot. Uh, it won't uh, twist and warp with uh, more moisture, less moisture, and so forth. So openings don't open up between the wood where air can get through in various seasons. So vinyl is really the uh, uh, ideal material to use and it lowers your maintenance cost. No painting, uh, it looks good, uh, you know, basically forever. I have this label here and it has uh, several things on it. The most important one being the U factor. And the U factor of this window is 0.31 and that's very good. Uh, the lower the U factor, the better. Now the U factor is the inverse of the R factor. Um, R factor is the resistance to heat flow and it's how insulation and 
various uh, wall and building assemblies are rated. A window or a door is always the weak spot in the thermal boundary of the house or a weak spot in the uh, thermal efficiency of any wall. It's always going to be colder than the wall. This window is going to be twice as energy efficient as a window with a U-value of 0.6. Um, so the lower the U-value, the better. If we take a look at our thermal imaging camera, we see that the glass on the window that we did not do is 50 degrees and look at the difference. The glass on the window that we did do is 67 degrees. Wow, what a difference. Well, that's the last of them. That's another quality window job by Dr. Energy Saver. If you need replacement windows in your home, call Dr. Energy Saver. We can help you with that and any home energy conservation need in your house. Uh, insulation, air sealing, duct repair, high efficiency heating and air conditioning, and water heating. Call Dr. Energy Saver. We'll be glad to help you.